Yo, Eddie Sims here, EST Established Media, back once again with an album review for you. Yeah, whilst everyone has been losing their mind over the new Creeper album, uh, rightly so, it's a fantastic record, it's a long time coming, I have been quietly enjoying the new Brutality Will Prevail record in dark places. Now, Brutality Will Prevail are a hardcore band from Wales, but they're quite different from your average hardcore outfit. Uh, for one, they have a massive Doom influence involved in their sound, and, uh, and I'm talking Doom as in the oppressive, atmospheric, really lumbering riffs that sort of just take your head off. This band really, really take the word heavy and just sort of amplify it, and it's not heavy in your average hardcore way in the sense of, you know, beatdowns, aggression, and slams. Uh, Brutality Will Prevail really, really try to use riffs and ride along those bassline grooves with some fantastic vocals, really, really screamed in your face. They oh, get your blood pumping sort of vocals. And it just works together and it combines to create a really unique sound uh, for a hardcore band, which is kind of unheard of nowadays. And all of this is displayed on tracks like Penitence, where the band really, really display a keen understanding that they know exactly what the fuck they're doing. I mean, this track is, it's moody, it is oppressive, like I said, it's heavy as fuck. I mean, the riff at the end is just skull-crushing, and it's enjoyable, it's dynamic, the band are consistently putting out tunes that are different to everything else, and yet still inherently keeping their identity. In Dark Places takes the best parts of their older stuff from albums like Root of All Evil, but, you know, has the confidence and the modern kick and the modern mix of, all, you know, 2017 records. It, it's fantastic, to be fair. So yeah, the album opens up with a track called Serpents, and it kicks off with this rumbling bass line and then these huge sustained chords held over the top right before it just drops into this really, really pleasant riff, actually. I say pleasant, it's just a good riff to start it all off. It really sets the tone, lets you know that this is going to be a moody, atmospheric, and really dark album, to be fair. I mean, it is called In Dark Places, so pun not intended. But this is a doomy record, and the band definitely are not afraid to step outside of the box even more, with tracks like Nebus and Into the Gloom showing that, you know, they want to... They want to display that they can be more than just your average hardcore band. You know, these tracks are ambient. These tracks are, you know, they have clean vocals. They have clean guitar tones that juxtapose everything that you've already heard done fantastically well in the album. Admittedly, Intergloom is probably the weakest song on the record, but it is the most different and you have to, you have to give praise where praise is due. I mean, the band have actively tried to do something different it didn't hit the mark, but Nebus is a great little interlude track and it bucks the trend of just having random tunes that don't have any resemblance to the rest of the songs. Nebus, Intergloom and final track Elegy are three tunes that all creatively match but juxtapose the other six tunes on the record, creating, like I said, a really great dynamic within the record. Other highlights include second track Perpetual Lows and the first single Forever Restless, which is still an utterly punishing tune that will probably make you want to put your fist through the wall. So make sure you have a plaster up on speed dial because yeah, you're going to want to get your office wall replaced. So ultimately, In Dark Places is a really, really interesting hardcore record that sets Brutality Will Prevail even further apart from the rest of the hardcore pack in the best possible way. The album is dynamic, the doom influences are done with genuine confidence, and even though the tracks where they step even further outside the box aren't necessarily the best they've done, Elegy is a fantastic mixture of the ambient, more calmer, cleaner toned guitar tracks uh, and just the doom and that hardcore and their bass sound. Brutality Will Prevail are really, really stepping up their game and In Dark Places is a fantastic record, 100% worth your time. Do go check it out.